there is an odd proverb in Urdu, when you do a good deed, bury it deep down in a lake. For a very long time, you know, when I was donating, even my wife didn't know about it. But I think what I have seen and learned over the past five years is the more you talk, it encourages more people to donate. Whatever you can contribute is incredibly valuable. You kind of owe it for the opportunities that were given to you and for future generations. It is such an important part of being a Rhodes alum uh, and really simple and easy for us to do. You just go on the website and you click some buttons. <laughs> In my class of 2011, we are still all fairly young in our careers and uh, we all contribute uh, in various ways. I suppose I thought, you know, what difference can I make given that I earn, you know, an academic salary? But it occurred to me that it would still be valuable and actually making the commitment to give meant that I sort of found the funds and prioritised that. Donating regularly, you do get connected a little bit more. A few months ago, I received a handwritten note from one of the scholars thanking me for the donation. It was an emotional thing to receive because uh, I also felt it would, it would have been me writing that letter to somebody, although the handwriting honestly was much better than I could ever write. Giving to Rhodes has reminded me of how the scholarship shaped my life and the arc that it's taken. I grew up in a small town in India and I had hopes and aspirations of understanding physical phenomena. The Rhodes Scholarships gave me the courage to pursue something that was genuinely difficult and to excel in it. There's a lot of history to the Rhodes Scholarships. Some of it good, some of it questionable, but that made me feel like I needed to give back. I wanted to make sure that other Zimbabwean scholars and other scholars from Southern African region had the opportunity to take advantage of the learning opportunities that Oxford has to give. The Rhodes Trust hasn't remained static. I think the fact that we have a female warden is a huge change, overdue, but very much welcome. With time, you sometimes do think that certain things are not possible, but when you talk to people who are still students who have much blue sky thinking, it opens up your eyes to a whole new world. Think back to the amazing people you met from right across the world. Be part of a community and sort of see this cycle of positivity and enablement being continued. <laughs>